Hello everyone, Lawrence here from Unicorn Reviews. Today we're doing a science, namely on the influence of your CPU on your graphics card performance. So for this test we're using Unigen Heaven, which is completely GPU dependent. It shouldn't be influenced by the CPU. And so that's what we're going to test. Is it actually influenced by a CPU depending on whatever you're using. So I have two identical systems, both are running 8 gigabytes of DDR3 at 1600 megahertz in single channel mode because I have disabled one of the slots in my own PC. Both are running GTX 970s at 1300 megahertz. Everything's identical with the systems except for one component, namely the CPU. In the further system at the back in the Ento, there is an i5 running at 5 gigahertz. So this is an D-lit Ivy Bridge chip. And this one we have an Athlon um, 5350 running at 2.05 gigahertz. So that's a massive difference. And we're going to try and find out what effect that has on our benchmark. All right then guys, results are up. I did this test three times just to make sure that everything's consistent and it is. So on the i5 system right there, uh, we get 1,742 points. Whereas on the Athlon system, we're only getting 1,292 points. Now keep in mind that an Athlon and an AM1 board will set you back around about 100 euros, whereas the i5 and the cooler to get that 5 gigahertz and the motherboard will set you back somewhere in the neighborhood of 600. So it's six times the price and we get 35% more performance. Guys, let me know what you think about videos like this in the comment area. What is the conclusion according to you guys? I'm not doing it this time because there is a difference, but obviously we're having some CPU bottlenecks going on with our Athlon system that's quite obvious right so don't mention that in the comments but what do you think about videos like this do you want to see more weird nerdy experiments which are completely pointless because we all know what would happen but just not how much anyway guys if you liked the video press that like button if you didn't press the dislike button you can leave a comment you can share this video with your friends and thank you all very much for watching